There's a little pouch. Oh yeah, that's right. Your grades are terrible. No university will take you. Man, he was so close to sending grape too. I'd have been fiending on grape. Your parents want you to get a job, but you don't like to work. Okay. You have no skills, no education, and no prospects. Things look bleak. There is one thing you're good at, though. Hitting on girls. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, I know. Clean up, suit up, and hit Shibuya. You're going to make it in the world of professional hosting. What did he say? He said rinse your booty off? What did he say? You've got an interview with the eccentric Toby Lau, and it starts now. You walk into Baller Industries host bar for your interview with the infamous Toby Lau. What What's your it? name? What do you want? What did I say? Really? What's your name? No. <clears throat> What's your name? What do you want? Oh, man. Ugh. Stop. Jason Trish, and I want to be a host. Jason Trish. I love the sound of that. Jesus. That's the name of a real it's fucking nice voice name. acting in this? There's no chance that someone could mistake you for a girl. My name's Toby Lau, but everyone here calls me Homo Lau. No, why? <laughs> why do they call you Homo Lau? Uh. You own a house? What? Homeowner Lau? <laughs> because you are gay? Because you are gay? Me? I'm one of the least gay people in all of Tokyo. Do you know how many women I've hooked up with? Uh, many. Practically all of the women in Tokyo. You clearly don't have hosting skills at all. His name is Homo Lao, but he's not gay. I don't get it either. No! The fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Shit. What's your name? What do you want? Jason Tri My name I don't know. You don't know? A host has to be hyper confident. Even when you don't know, you need to pretend you do. Girls working here are looking for men, not boys. Dick? It's because I'm a homeowner. A homo for sure. It's a sign of respect. None of these other hosts can afford their own place. That's what makes me number one. Where did you go to school? Baller Industries is a brilliant game development studio. What? That's not... That's not charming. Well, you didn't answer my question, but who can argue with what you said? I see that you are very smart. I was asking a trick question. Only an amateur host would answer such a boring question. Excuse me? I'm the one asking questions here. Now, for a little role play. I'm the girl. You're the host. Entertain me. You sure this isn't why they call you Homo Lao? Hey, hello, handsome host. What have you been up to this week? See many girls? Ask her a question, right? Will you prefer to lose your sense of smell or to turn into a duck for one hour every day? What the fuck? Wow, this is a difficult question. I love the scent of perfume and candy and flowers, just like most girls. So I'd have to be a duck for an hour every day. I think he's doing like an Indian girl or something, right? <laughs> Does that kind of sound like that? It sounds much better at first, but imagine you were driving your sports car down a highway. Then suddenly you turn from a pretty girl into a duck. You won't be able to reach the foot pedals. Even if you could, you couldn't see over the steering right. wheel. Being a duck would have some drawbacks. 
I'm very hey, get in character, homo. Not only did you deftly avoid a tricky question, but you opened up a topic of conversation Sorry. that could go on for hours. Well done. The ladies will love your unique style of chat. So, Jason, I think you've got what it takes to be one of Homo Lao's boys. In fact, stick with me and you might one day gain Homo status. Homo Trish. It's got a nice ring to it. One last thing. What's your ID card number? All right, great. You're going to be on probation for the first month. You'll be cleaning toilets, clearing out ashtray. Victory. Fuck yeah. You arrive at Baller Industries host bar for your first. Okay, whatever. <clears throat> Clean floor, remove toilet roll, clear ashtray. You fish out that toilet roll from the bowl. Toby probably placed it there. That's funny to him. You wipe up the vomit from the floor. You chuck the cigarette butts out the window. Hey! Did I say he's feeling sick? The fuck was that? Apparently he has a whole host of diseases. <laughs> <laughs> now normally I'd have you cleaning for a while longer, but I'm feeling generous. So here's your chance. There's a Toby? Are we friends? No, I'm your employer, new guy. Don't act so familiar. You can call me Mr. Lau, Toby Lau, Homo Lau, or Homo Toby Lau. But you can never just call me Alright, let's get to the girl. The girl you are with is very pretty, <laughs> but she looks very grumpy. Debatable. What will you do she to put her either. in a partying mood? Play a drinking game. Let's play piggy in the middle. Ooh. Or let's play piggy in the middle. Let's let's play piggy in the middle. Oh, piggy. What the fuck is piggy in the middle? Piggy in the middle with just the two of us? I don't think that will work. Or be fun. And get your friend. Uh, good point. We can play something no, else. Thanks. Jeez. Is this your first night? Hosts are supposed to be way more fun. It's not going well. Think of something to do. Completely freeze up or make a racing car noise. <laughs> These are my options. <laughs> What the fuck? Silent protagonist, no longer silent. I thought I was doing the fucking voices around here. Ah! Oh shit. The fuck was that? It even kind of sounded like me. It seriously sounded like I yelled into a mic. how much it is one dollar in all that voice acting that's kind of an incredible price <laughs> oh man <laughs> I might I'll, maybe I'll come by this and maybe I'll buy it homo Lau. I don't I want to become one of homo Lau's boys Homo Brad. What the fuck was that? You pick up the toilet roll. Why did they voice act that part? Why was that even something I did? If I did them in the wrong order, would I have fucked up? <laughs> 